Hey, how's everybody doing? It's Robert from Cassius Collection, and I got another Kinder Joy video for you today. Uh, today is the spring edition, uh, the Easter edition. Um, now, as of recording this video, uh, today is um, the 8th of April. Uh, tomorrow is Easter. Uh, for those that celebrate, uh, happy Easter. Um, so I figured I'd open these today um, to show everybody what was in the Kinder Joy Easter slash Spring Edition. Uh, so let's start cracking these open and see what we get. Uh, let's open the first one here. Ah, weird. They changed the uh, style of the spoon. Um, went from the traditional spoon that has been the spoon for forever to that style. This is the original style that I remember having for a long time to this interesting style. I guess it's maybe this, and this was the NBA once that I opened. Um, but I wonder if it was easier to manufacture, uh, you know, the style spoon, uh, you know, over, you know, over the the original style but anyway let's see what we got here take this out pop this open here and here is the front of it um, looks like it's got some pretty cool different ones if we take a look at this, so if if we're just going by what's on the paperwork, we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh, but sometimes there's more than, uh, you know, just what's on the paperwork. So going by what's on the paperwork, we have six of them. And what it looks like that we have uh, is the actual um, bunny rabbit, uh, the the first one that we got. So let's take a look. So we have weird eyes because uh, this is the one part of them. <laughs> and, and then we have the other part of them. So this is his back, his ears, and his hands that snap into the weird looking of his eyes there. So um, there's a hole here. Goes into the, the, um, the peg there peg up here goes into the hole that's right here so this is going to snap together just like that and now we have a two-toned rabbit and the rabbit goes into the base you'll see the kind of oval slot right there matches up with the oval uh, peg and this snaps right in place now, this is a toss game with uh, um, a wreath ring. So you'll see the wreath ring right here. And it's meant to try to throw and get it over top of his head. So that's what it looks like, the game right there. So you'll see uh, the tossing of the wreath to get over his head. So that's the first one that we pulled from the set. And let's go to the next one. See what we have here. Okay, and the next one, it's a different one, so that's good. Let's take a look. I see a bird. <coughs> Excuse me. And open the wrapper. And see, now, that's what I was saying. So the one that we did open up is not on this paper. So, here it is here. So, we have a bird. Looks like here. That's his big front feet. There's his tail. His tail goes into this round hole. Round peg. His tail pops in place. And there's his tail. 
And as far as this is concerned, there's a peg here and a peg here. And it looks like this snaps into the little pegs. And you can flip him up and down. And so how he does here. So it looks like what you're doing is you're taking this basket. This basket wraps like this into a basket shape. And the idea is to take these flowers that pop out. And you're taking the flowers and you're putting them onto the back end of his tail. And then you're flicking it to try to get the flowers into the basket. So if you see right here, see the flowers are there. You put the flower on top of the back of his tail and you're trying to flick it into the basket. So that's the concept of that one. So that's two down. So far we got two different ones. Let's open another. Here's the third one. Let's see. The third one is going to be another different one. So that's great. We're doing great on this one. So, so far, three with three different ones. This looks like it's going to be a wreath game as well. Trying to get it around the, the looks like the tail of the, um, I'm not quite sure what this is. So let's take a look at it after we put it together. M maybe a squirrel. So let's put them together here. So you'll see two round pegs on this side go into the two round slots on that side. It's this front part of his body with his eyes. Lines up. Snaps in. And yes, looks like a squirrel. And there he is, a little squirrel. And the little squirrel then snaps into the display and goes into the display just like that. And then the concept of the game is to try to get the wreath around the squirrel's tail. Now, I'm seeing that these are kind of similar. So I'm just curious if maybe... At some point, these guys, you know, do go together. Eh, maybe there's no, there's no regular designs or shapes on it. So maybe that cutout is just, you know, a coincidence. But so we have three different ones so far. And we're keep going. We have four more to open. And here's the next one. Let's see. Oh, we got a double. This one is going to be the rabbit. So we got a double there. Open in another one. Let's see what this one is. Oh, this one looks different. So now we got four different ones. This one is the chicken. Pop open the paperwork. There's the front of the paperwork again. And here's the back showing how we put the chicken and its parts together. So it looks like the chicken has a front and back part. So it looks like we have a round hole there. Round peg right here. Put the two parts of the chicken together. To line him up right there. Looks like it should go together there. Here we go. Now the chicken is together. Now we need to take the chicken and put it into 
the little cart. So let's take a look at the paperwork real quick. So the chicken and the cart go together. Looks like the, the wing is kind of out. So there you go. Now the chicken and the cart are together. And now... Ah, uh, interesting. I wonder if his feet... Does his feet go out of it? Uh, I guess his feet can't go out of it. I guess he kind of just sits in there. So there's the chicken. We have two more. Let's see what we get. Oh, and we got a different one. This is a different chicken. So here's the front. Well, this one looks more like a rooster because of this big tail. And here is the back of it. <coughs> so this pops out because this is part of his tail. This pops out. And it looks like it goes around here. Then the chicken rooster actually goes together just like that. And you see his tail right out the back. And then and then he's supposed to sit on top of the little roost that he has here. And there he is, rooster on his little roost. And so there is four that we have. Five different ones, actually. And here is the last one. Opening it up, and it got stuck. And it is a double... And this is the bird. So the last one is a double. So we got five different ones, which is not bad. Uh, we did pretty well. So not too bad on the five different ones that we got. Making a mess here with all the stuff. It's all the paper and everything coming from the cardboard. So this flew out of it when I opened it up. So let's put that back in here. And we got two doubles. So not too bad. Two doubles out of everything we had. And so we have the chicken here inside of the little basket. So that's there. We have the bird that flips the flowers. We have the rabbit that should throw the wreath over his head. We have the squirrel that you throw the wreath over his tail. And we have the rooster up on his roost. So looking at the paperwork, there's definitely a couple more. So, but it looks like we got 
almost everything that's on this paper. We didn't get the rabbit that goes inside of a basket. And we didn't get uh, this guy. I mean, it looks kind of like a monkey over there uh, carrying a couple pails of water. So, but we did get a couple that it's not, we did get one that's not on here. We did get the bird that's not on here. Uh, so that's always a, a plus. And we did get the rabbit that is not on here because this is a different rabbit than what we got. And I don't know about that rabbit because that rabbit is a different color. So I don't know whether that's just a different color because of the way that it's drawn. Um, but here are the ones that we got. So right here, let's pick the rooster back up and put him back on his roost. And so we... He, there we go. And so those are the ones that we got. So if you like this type of video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Leave a comment. Subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. Uh, we're almost at 400 subscribers. Uh, definitely come a long way. I do appreciate everybody that has subscribed and has watched the channel. Um, so I want to say thank you for everybody that has watched my videos. And if you like this, definitely continue to support uh, by leaving a like and a comment and uh, sharing if you feel so uh, inclined. But if you like this, definitely leave a comment, hit the thumbs up button, and hit that bell icon if you're a subscriber so you know when I have new videos. Always doing Kinder Joy videos, always doing surprise egg videos. Uh, so you'll see more stuff on this channel, definitely. Uh, but... If you like this, leave a comment and enjoy the adventure.